And the Los Blancos, they are back to their winning ways with, after thumping Real Sociedad 5-1 in the Santiago Bernabeu. Courtesy of goals from Karim Benzema, two from him, two from Ronaldo, one from Iguain, and one from Chabi Prieto. Now, I told you guys in the pre-match analysis that I'll be watching the match, but I was so tired that I didn't hear my alarm to wake up. Because in Spain, when it's 10 o'clock, over here in Singapore, it's 3 a.m. So yeah, so I wanted I set the alarm at 2 30. But then I didn't even hear the alarm and yeah, my phone alarm is supposed to be quite loud, so you I was really tired. Sorry if I look tired and sweaty now it's really really hot outside. So yeah. Now so I'll give you an analysis of the goal so first one was from Iguain pass, nice pass from Benzema and then it went and then like it just kicked it inside and then it went inside evaded the goalkeeper. Now, Ronaldo's first goal in the match was a classic Ronaldo goal. He comes from the left, and then goalkeeper runs up to him, and then he shoots on the right of the goalkeeper, just going inside the net. That is a classic Ronaldo goal. Now, um, then after that, Xabi Prieto equalized with a header that took a deflection off Sejo Ramos, and as a result, went over Iker, Iker Casillas, even though he was diving. It went into the top corner. Not say the top corner, but the top right. Yeah. So then after that, uh, Benzema scored, um, I forgot what goal he scored, yeah, he, he scored, um, after that, yeah, he scored a chip, I think, yeah, it was a really nice chip, it was a really beautiful pass out of nowhere, and then Benzema did the dribbling, it was quite fantastic, even though he controlled the ball once, he controlled the ball very acrobatically, chipping, like, make, like, put, kicking it a bit up. So the next time he could just chip over the goalkeeper. So it just went over the goalkeeper, went way high, way high over the goalkeeper and it landed into the back of the net quite nicely. Then after that Benzema's goal was a power shot when he came from the left. Uh, the goalkeeper probably had no chance. And then the last one was also a classic Ronaldo goal this time from Iguain coming from the right flank, passing the ball and then Ronaldo just tapping it into the back of the net with his usual speed, evading the goalkeeper with ease. So yeah, that is a 5-1 victory and we are back to winning ways. We, we're slowly taking back what we were robbed of against Villarreal from the re crazy referee. Meantime, in Barcelona, Barcelona win 2-0 against Mallorca. One goal from Messi and the other goal from Donovan. So, uh, I don't know who's the other, who's who scored the other goal and <laughs> I'm too lazy to check. So Ronaldo and Messi are equal on goals 36 points and we maintain that 6 point lead at the top of the table with quite not many matches to go so we have a really good cushion. Next match is against Osasuna in the Reno de Navarra which is away from home. So that match I'll be showing I'll be doing the pre-match analysis but before that if I'm not wrong before the Osasuna match is our Champions League quarterfinal first round against Apoel. Yes, it is. 27th of March against Apoel, the Cypriot team. The only, the first Cypriot team ever to reach around 16. And after that, the quarterfinals. So, as we are Real Madrid, we do respect our opponents. So, yeah. So, Real Madrid will be doing their best. The first game will be away. That will be in Cyprus. Then next week, Cyprus, sorry. Um, then the second game will be in the Santiago Bernabeu, so that should be go quite well. I'll give my pre-match analysis for both against Osasuna and the other and Upwell, and hopefully I'll give in some guitar lessons too. Since I've been totally busy, I really apologize for that. So yes, thank you for watching my review. I'll see you soon in one of my later videos. And Hala Madrid.